All right, y'all, we have some melted butter here. It's about a tablespoon and a half. Move this around the pan. Y'all can spray it too if you'd like, but that's how I like doing it. All right, I have uh, three cups of cooked egg noodles. I'm just gonna mix this around. Yes, I'm using my hands. I know y'all glove police, you're gonna be on me about this, but guess what? It works, that's why I'm doing it. All right, next y'all, we're taking a can of cream of mushroom soup, one can. One can, comes right out, nice and easy. We have a, a third of a cup of whole milk. I'm gonna pour that in as well. And then we're taking one cup of shredded cheddar cheese. So I'm just guessing, but I think that's about a cup. That might be a little more, but guess what? That's fine. Never, there's never such thing as too much cheese. All right, we're gonna mix this up. Mixy, mixy. And we're mixing it right in our casserole dish. Y'all, you know how I feel. If y'all wanna mix it separate and then put it in, go ahead. Uh, if that makes you happy, guess what? That makes me happy too, right? All right, we're just gonna mix this real good. All right, y'all, y'all gonna love this dish. I'm so excited. Next, we're taking a bag of frozen peas and carrots. Right down the middle. Look how good that looks so far, y'all. All right, and now we have some canned tuna, all right? I'm gonna get this out. I, I drained it pretty good. We're using four cans, all right? You can use less or more, but we're making a delicious tuna casserole, and there's nothing worse than a tuna casserole with not enough tuna, all right, y'all? That's what we're doing right here. So I'm just gonna break this up, and again, we're gonna give this a rough mix, all right? Just, but just like so. So y'all can customize this however you'd like. I love tuna casserole. I grew up, my granny made it for me when I was a little girl and I loved it. So you know what, it's like one of those comfort foods. It just makes me feel, it makes me feel good. It warms my heart and I love making it. If y'all, y'all, I'm sure y'all have a tuna casserole. If y'all have a good recipe, let me know or let me know what y'all would do different, all right? Because I always want to get better and I like hearing what y'all say. All right, yep, a little bit messy, but that's all right, that's how I do. All right, y'all, that looks perfect. So I'm gonna get this off. Yep, I am using my fingers. I'm using my fingers. Y'all, don't look at my nails. I need a manicure. They look kind of bad right now. All right. Next, we have some panko breadcrumbs. All right, so we're gonna, we're gonna sprinkle this on the top. Now, I'm not measuring these, y'all. I'm just like putting a nice little layer on top. So uh, yeah, that's it. Nice little layer. I don't know, thin, a medium layer. Not too thin, not too thick, all right? And then we're gonna do a little bit of uh, parsley. Oops, okay, that's kind of a lot, but that's all right. Parsley's good. And we're gonna do a little bit more cheese, just a little bit, okay? And this is just for like the topping, just a little, little bit, little bit. That's good. All right, y'all, last thing here. Have some melted butter. So we're just gonna drizzle this on top. It'll help those, those breadcrumbs get nice and crispy. Little bit, this is about two tablespoons, all right? So not too much butter. All right, y'all, that's it. So we're gonna put this in the oven. I have it set at 350. We're gonna do this about 30 minutes, y'all, and I'm so excited to show y'all my take of a delicious tuna casserole. All right, y'all, here we have our delicious tuna casserole. Well, my take on a tuna casserole. I'm sure the one my granny used to make is still better, but we have uh, four cans of canned tuna in here. Four cans of canned tuna. That didn't make any sense. All right, anyways, let's continue. <laughs> Uh, we have some cheese, we have tuna, we have vegetables, egg noodles. I love tuna casserole. If y'all have a good tuna casserole recipe, y'all gotta let me know, all right? Look at how good that looks. Oh, it's still hot too. I love tuna casserole. It's like, it's like my favorite comfort food. If I'm ever feeling down or sad or anything, I make me some tuna casserole and life is good, all right? Time to try it. Time to try it. With my shredded cheese that I shred by myself. Well, actually, my food processor did it, but whatever. Y'all you know, know what I mean. All right, let's 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 get... Okay, I'm using my hands. Don't get mad. Here we go. Time to try it. It's going to be so good. I love tuna. It's going to be so good, y'all. I'm so, so excited to try this. All right, here we go. Mmm! Mmm! Y'all. Y'all, this is so good. Y'all have to try it. 